the Zero Dark Fest. Yo, we are in the studio today. I have a camera set up. I have my monitor right here, which maybe I'm looking off camera sometimes. But I got some new um, jackets for the winter, and I want to talk a little bit, bit about them. This is the Zero Dark vest. Um, a lot of you have seen me taking photos with the Zero Dark jacket. Um, I have a couple of them. The other one is the camo one that came out last year. It came out in camo and black, and this year it comes out in this awesome green, which I seem to wear this all the time. But what I didn't think I'd wear all the time is the vest. So the vest is a little bit different. It doesn't have a logo here. It does have the little hanger back here. Um, it doesn't have a hood, and but it does have the side zip um, breakaways for when you conceal carry. You can get at it real quick. Zippers move real good. Um, and they only zip one way. Some jackets zip up and down for different reasons to access. Um, but this one zips down. Uh, I prefer just to zip down so I could pull and reach. Maybe if you're wearing a plate carrier, you can tuck, just have a little vest, grab your stuff, and get at it. But uh, they probably didn't put the logo here in, uh, in a hood, so you can actually layer this, which is a really good idea and something that um, we don't have enough of. Um, I don't have a vest in my collection, now I do, and I think I'm going to be using all time, and I do use this actually when I'm editing and stuff at my desk. It comes in really handy that, you know, you're moving your arms, you're doing a bunch of stuff, and you don't have sleeves on, but you're keeping your core warm, which I do live in San Diego, but for some reason when it's warm outside, they make it freezing at our, in our offices and at our desks. So, this is the Zero Dark um, vest. Similar inside to the, um, the full jacket, it has a big elastic pocket here, and then it has a little baby one here, and it's the same on this side. These are pretty hefty. Um, they have an outside pocket that uh, does zip up also. See so you your little zip pocket for your hand, which you use all the time. And then you have your big pockets in the inside, which I use usually for gloves, truthfully. Um, I don't put much more than gloves in here, but I do put gloves. Sometimes I put a pen or something, um, something loose. And then you have your big outside pockets, which uh, they're Velcroed shut. You have little pull tabs if you want to use them, or just grab your pocket, get in them. Actually, you'll use sometimes I'll use the inner for gloves, or I'll use these for gloves or beanies and stuff. Um, like this weekend, I was uh, at a surf contest, and I'll be sticking beanies in this after you start peeling off layers, you start putting them in places. So that is a zero dark vest. Has a little hanger right here. You can throw it on something. Attention to detail. The little. Victos logo with the little three molly thing like they always do on all their jackets. Um, yeah, solid piece of product clothing that I wear all the time. It even has a little Victos tab right here. It's nice. The Zero Dark jacket. Let's talk about the jacket itself. Zero Dark jacket. This one is in there green, which is like a, uh, I would say, almost like a army green. Maybe it's, it's a little darker than it looks on camera, probably. Maybe I'll color correct a little bit. Um, does go pretty high. Has a Victos logo right here. Pretty subtle, as you can see, which I like. Same exact pockets here on the outside beanies, gloves, 
has the elbow pads now that I see them in the camera, that they're really reinforced elbow pads. Um, they have this other material here, which, let me see what it says it is. Four-way spandex underneath, so when you're moving, you get a little bit more flexibility, but it has breathable holes for your pits, and this one does have an up and down zipper, which I only usually use the bottom one. Get at something, tuck, have a carrier or something when you're doing some training in cold weather, or if you just want to roll with the minimal list, you can, this will fit two mags. Let's check out the inside. Inside has one, just one big pocket on this side with their, um, one of their logos. And this side has a big pocket and a little pocket. And this one actually has a hood. So let's get out this. I haven't, un haven't undid this hood yet. So both versions, the jackets, they all kind of have a hood. This one peels out of normally out of the collar. Side profile. And I actually have used this um, at a contest where I just brought this jacket and it was pretty cold and the hood did come in handy. Tuck it in so I don't zip it. There it is. There's a little hanger here when you're hanging on something. Let's take a closer look at the pits. So it has your vent holes. Let's see if I can get an angle on those things. It does have the dip down zip. But the air holes, you'd be surprised how warm you get and they do come in really handy. And this is the whole side of it is the flex. If I put it on, it'll be a little bit better. Let's see. You can see the difference. There it is. Flexible. So, um, that is the Zero Dark jacket. These are pretty much um, they're not as um, compact as those little jackets you can put, you know, in your little puffy jackets you just stuff in your backpack. They do stuff pretty small, but they're not as small as those, but they are warmer than those, I'll tell you that. With um, Thermalite Core insulation, um, I don't know a lot about it, but it keeps you really warm. That's the only thing that matters. Uh, I've had my other one for a year. Feels like it's day one. I took a couple spills on my skateboard. Actually had to use my elbow pads, but um, that's it. That is the Zero Dark jacket. The Kruger jacket. This is the Kruger jacket. Say it's like between a um, sweatshirt and a jacket, but it is definitely more like a jacket. Um, let's go over it. I'll do a spin around. Oh. Talk about this jacket really quick. Let's do this turn around. Normal pockets right here. Kind of, this feels kind of sweatshirtish, I guess. Pull over. Attention to detail on the pull tabs. Got a little logo, Victus logo right there. Uh, really nice park pockets. They have the pull away zippers on the side. They go up and down. Get to your concealed carry. Or, I doubt you're going to do this, but plate carrier, or I mean a um, chest rig, tuck it in, 
wear it, keep you warm. Has the protection pad, elbow pads right there. Um, has that kind of the same material on the shoulders. Um, let's check out the hood a little bit. Does zip super high and gives you more of that um, cold weather protection with these cool pull tabs right here for it. Um, let's take a, oh, also on the outside, you have these little storage pockets here, these little almost hideaway zippers, but you have little storage compartments right here, little pockets. You can put something right here if you have like a chest rig or something and you don't, and these aren't accessible. And you have these little areas right here you could put something in. Um, kind of like they're little, they have these on a couple other things. These little zippers are like little hideaway zippers. Got hard to get that angle there. Have them on both sides. Is it that one? Have a little area notes or something. And this is a really good looking jacket. Looks a little bit more, not formal, but like you can get away with, you know, I wear it at work. Doesn't seem all tactical out. Um, super warm. 75% poly, 21% um, are um, acrylic and 4% wool, which is probably that 4% is in the, uh, the liner, which I'll show you in a second. Uh, let's see. Um, has a water resistant coating. Take a look at these hoods. I love their design. It's just not like a normal hood. It has like a flat piece that goes in so it sits a little better on your head. It has a normal Victos uh, little three molly thing right here on the back and their little logo. Pretty clean back, which you don't want too much back there, but it's almost like a waffle kind of um, pattern in the inside. And it's super warm. And the same, it goes all the way into the hood. It didn't skimp out there, it goes all the way up. Let's talk about these uh, pockets. So you have one of those big pockets right here you can just throw your beanie or your glove into so it has a little hole for your um, if you have your uh, phone in there you want to run a cord and listen to something so has your laser cut right here for any kind of um, you know if you want to have your phone in your pocket and then run your audio through here to go up through your jacket it also has one right here so I'm assuming you could put your phone here and come out with your headphones if you're not running Bluetooth. Same big pockets. Also has a secondary zipper pocket in the inside right here. So this is where you'd keep it and run your audio cable through. Seems like it's only on the left side. But you do have another zippered pocket internally right here and um, that's about it pretty well thought out attention to detail hopefully I can show you they're like dipped the real little ends are dipped in rubber closer look oh. It's a good looking jacket. Yeah. It. Yeah. It's almost like little highways. So Let's see, look at how they're that flat cut. It's just not all just one piece of material. They do these extra cuts for comfort.
This is a medium. Runs pretty true to size. Um, I'm a medium. Fits pretty good. Doesn't feel too square or anything. Cuffs. Has a Victos logo right here. There's a cuffs. Almost like a black elastic, but not too tight. Definitely stick a, have your gloves and it'll fit underneath that.